Good evening, ladies and gentlemen in Grand Colony in Nigeria. You are hearing the voice of the elder state person, Reverend Dr. Bartolomeo Agbecheno, coming your way this day, the 1st of August, 2024. God bless you. A very quick one, I am coming up to react to the VN that the chameleon called Body David just released. The VN that the chameleon Body David just released. Body David number one is a very haughty person. His pride is too much with him. And the amazing thing is that his brain does not contain much. I don't want to say that his brain does not contain anything because everybody's brain contains something. Even a madman, even a foolish person. But David's brain does not contain much and he is bringing himself to the public he is always bringing himself to the public i had said sometime that if you don't know much don't bring yourself to the open if you don't know much and you don't bring yourself to the open People will not know how weak you are. People will not know how derailed you are. But they, David, why not look for somewhere and hide yourself? You will say you are a first class material from where? Is it from OAU? Obafemi Aulo University? or ZIC University or ABU or where? The first class you say you got is not showing up all because anytime you speak, people see illiteracy, people see ignorance, people see loopholes. And you will not be quiet. You will not be quiet. You vaunt yourself too much. Even the 12,000 clusters you say you have, probably when they put it into scrutiny, you will notice that maybe the, the, the clusters may not be even up to 2,000. It may not even be up to 2,000. Because it may be so that you made one single name to repeat for about 50 times in the same cluster. A single name may repeat for about 50 times in a single cluster. And you come up and say you have 12,000 clusters. That is the kind of person probably that you are. You want yourself too much. You say revival in Africa. Who knows you in Pape, where you are staying? Before talking of Buari, area council, before talking of FCT, before talking of the North Central region, before talking of Nigeria, before talking of West Africa, and before talking of Africa, Body David. You vaunt yourself too much. Your pride is too much. And so fortunately for you, you have gullible folks whose brains are like your own. That when you talk, you can carry a few of them along. You are promising of uh, training. Training. <laughs> can body David train somebody? You will train somebody with what language? You go and stay in their front and will be telling them that is what you will use to train people. That is what you will use to train people. 
Yes, you will get people like Abiros to train people who have never been to school. Those are the people that what you say may be useful to them. What you say may be useful to them. But then you, you came up and you were trying to vaunt yourself about Mama Supreme so that you can claim that you have a name in Supreme Family Initiative International. Because you know that Supreme is about to happen. As I stay here, I knew that Supreme is about to happen for the past six months. I kept quiet. I didn't say anything about it. You can ask Mama Supreme. It's my daughter. It will tell you. I said I will never talk about anybody again until disbursement. Even yesterday, I was in his office. He gave me, she gave me a presidential welcome as elder statesman. I won't go further on it. You can put a call across to Mama Supreme to find out whether what I am saying is true or false. I told her that by the moment she disburses, by the moment she disburses, I will come on air. I will come on air. I have been very, very patient. Like some people who use paper to deceive people. Like I learned that uh, Temi Topa again took uh, Epic to see DHR and was showing them paper. Temi Topa LME in Balogun, where we are now, is no longer paper. What we are looking for is disbursement. Is disbursement. Well, let me leave Elemi Balogu because she is not the topic of this discussion for now. Uh, Bonnie David came talking about uh, Mama Supreme as if she has a good name in Mama Supreme. As if she has a good name in Mama Supreme. I had to call Mama Supreme. Is that chameleon your friend? You say, how can that person be her friend? The person that she went and locked up in Badagri because of the fraud he committed. Me, I, I never knew anything about Bode David up till now until I have to find out. You, all of you, you know that I'm a discreet person. I don't go into talking anyhow. And that is why when I talk, nobody can take me to court. If you take me to court for what I say, you take yourself to court because I will floor you. Because I will ensure that I have a backup before I come out. Mama Supreme, that person that calls himself Body David, that acts like a chameleon, is he your friend? Mama Supreme said no. The person that collected subscription money from his people and ate it up. And I asked Mama Supreme how much Mama Supreme told me 700,000 Naira. But then David went and collected 700,000 Naira from the subscribers under him and he ate it up and he came and told mama supreme that uh, he was duped and mama supreme knew that he was lying mama supreme knew that he was lying and you know what mama supreme did mama supreme went and locked him up in a police station in badagri I am speaking with evidences. Mama Supreme is there. You know, I am mentioning him. That is how the elder statesman talks. And Mama Supreme again told me that my friend was aware. My friend, Pastor Jennifer Isaac, was aware. 
That is the track record of Body David. Me, I never knew this before. If I had known this before, I would have used it to insult him. I would have used it to insult him. There are so many other insults of Body David that are high below that I will be knowing them one after the other. And I will take them to hit his head so that he can emanciate more. Because you know that Body David is like a squirrel. You know, get the body. So by the moment I begin to hit him more and more, he will emanciate more. Body David is a scammer. He's a fraud star. Mama Supreme has told me that he is a scammer. He went and collected the subscription money, totaling to 700,000 Naira from his uh, followers, and told them that he was going to give them to uh, Mama Supreme. And he didn't give the money to Mama Supreme, and he didn't tell Mama Supreme. Mama Supreme had to investigate and found out that but they, David had duped his people. Mama Supreme had to go and lock him up in a police station in Batagri. Ladies and gentlemen, but they, David is a dangerous front star. That is why he can easily befriend to you and he will be telling you, Tio is going to destroy. Yeah, you people relax there now, no problem. We did. We did because I have been wondering what has been drawing this body David close to you. Of course, bears of the same feather, they flock together. Body David, as I'm talking, you know, go and find out to if you see my insult, oh yeah, come and insult me. Come and insult me. If you see anything true about me that I've done wrong, if you come and you say it, I'll even be happy, sir. Because anything that makes manifest is life. If there is a way I'm doing something wrong that I don't even know, and you help me to know, it will help me. Because it will not stand against me anymore. But but then they be that you are somebody that is a hardened criminal. Even if they talk about the evil that you have done, up to tomorrow, it will not shake you. Because you have a kind of policy that you can come out and dupe people, you can come out and scam people. After some time, as you claim to be a man of God, you go to the mountain and pray and say that God should forgive you. You have said this, so you have said this, so in one of your views, you know, it's okay. This is the time to use the flesh. This is the time to use the flesh. Let me use the flesh. After some time, I will go and pray so that God will forgive me. This is the belief that you have with the person you are accompanying with. Mama Supreme told me that she locked you up in Bagdagri police station for scamming your people. You know me, I'm mentioning them so. By the moment you are coming eh, to say the wrong thing that I've done, eh? please be mentioning names. Don't... Eh, don't uh, don't just move over to be mentioning names for details be mentioning names for details and but they david because mama supreme drove you away from her company so that you don't tarnish her image you are not telling mama supreme not to bring people close to herself people of honesty and that is why we're saying that Mama Supreme should watch her back. You think that Mama Supreme is like you, that you went and they gave a very bad counsel concerning me. Because the time I fought for Tio, and I went to FCID because of Tio, you were one of those people counseling Tio not to call me, not to relate with me. The person that has fought with, has fought for Tio and defended Tio, it is clear before everybody, you were one of those who gave Tio bad counsel, who advised Tio badly. 
and that is what is landing to you where to you is today it is the same advice you are bringing to mama supreme that mama supreme should watch her back so that those that are wo are working with mama supreme mama supreme should drive them away and bring you close to herself except the next world except the next world if not for your information you can never be in mama supreme's camp again forever that is what she told me i am saying what she told you because i am surprised the kind of person that you are but then David, i am surprised if mama supreme that is my daughter can be in your company and she told me that she doesn't know you that she is 1000 miles away from you as mama supreme is succeeding now you try you are trying to come and get a name why have you not been speaking about her since why not leave why not leave because you came and attended the training a training for super coordinator and they allowed you and they didn't drive you away that is when you had the mouth to talk you are so lucky you didn't come yesterday that i was there if you had come yesterday that i was there i would have told them to drive you back to drive you back if there is any money you had paid in in, in mama supreme's organization i would have given it back to you because you are a devil you are a devil a devil incarnate blessed is anybody that is not in your company mama supreme is my daughter as i called her because i finished talking with her before i came up on air if she had told me that you are in her company i would have driven her far away from myself because i can never see anywhere that bode david is that is ever good i have never seen anywhere that bode david is that is ever good ladies and gentlemen that is what i have to tell you about bode david as many of you that are still in his camp Good luck to you. Tio shoots him because it is the kind of spirit that Tio has that he also has. So they are best of the same feather. But as many of you as are with but dear David, sorry for you. Sorry for you. The way he talked about uh, Mama Supreme. If I had not come up to talk in this way, you will now think that she has he has a good relationship with mama supreme he does not have good relationship with mama supreme mama supreme had once locked him up in badagri police police station for scamming his people before people appealed to mama supreme and mama supreme released him released him and he's coming up to talk as if he knows much about Mama Supreme's organization. He does not know anything. The success of Mama Supreme. He's saying that he's talking about two organizations. He's talking about Mama Supreme. Is it only Mama Supreme that uh, Buddy David had ever talked about? May I think that he had talked about other organizations? I don't have the time to go into those investigations. But one thing, I have to let you people know, anybody that is in Bode, Bode Davis camp should watch his back. Those that are working as a team with Mama Supreme, when I was in his office yesterday, when I was in her office yesterday and I saw them, I noticed that they are people of quality. 
both men and women. I won't mention them. I won't mention their names. And I blessed his disbursement chairman. I won't mention his name to you. His dispo her disbursement chairman is my son. Right now as I talk. And I was so happy. I asked her, where did you get this man from? Where did you get this man? As I am talking now, they are listening. I said, where did you get this man from? And I blessed that man. And I blessed Mama Supreme. Then Brother David is saying that she should walk, she should, uh, she should watch her back so that she should throw those people away so that he that is a chameleon will come back. It is too late for you. It is too late for you to cry when the head is up. You, Brother David, you don't have any place in Supreme. Because you are a dirty person. The place that suits you is Theobat. Remain there and continue to tell people that Theobat will this boss. Continue to tell people. We are here and we are watching. Shut up your mouth from Mama Supreme's organization. That is what Mama Supreme told me to tell you. He said, I should tell you to shut up your mouth from her organization. And this is a warning to all of you that are listening. But then David is not a material. And as he is not a material, he's not a clean person. He's a dirty person. I would like you people to be one. Anytime he is talking, be one. He will not stop talking. No. He will not stop talking. He will always be talking. But I would like you people to use your initiatives. Good evening.